Camping motherfucker. <laughs> You're camping on a head glitch. I literally just got there. This guy is getting so mad, bro. You love camping, don't you? There we go. And you're camping our spawn! Oh, you're seriously that much of a f***ing loser. You literally camped the whole game. Fuck, like, do you have no friends at all? <laughs> he said, do you not have any friends at all? Yo! What's going on, guys? Right away here, and welcome back to the channel. Hey, before watching, I'm only gonna give you guys five seconds to drop a like right now. This is the only shot you guys have at dropping a like throughout the whole entire video, so, I mean, I would not miss this. As y'all can see, man, today we are back on Black Ops 4. And I'm sure most of you guys are probably asking yourselves right away, why are you even on Black Ops 4 right now? Well, if you take a look at this tweet, it says right here, Call of Duty Black Ops 4 is now available for free with PlayStation Plus on PlayStation 4. Four, and you can also play it with uh, backwards compatibility on PlayStation 5. So if you're on PlayStation consoles and you have PlayStation Plus, you can literally download Black Ops 4 for free right now. And once you download it, it's yours to keep. So if I were you, if you guys have never touched Black Ops 4, if you guys have never experienced this game, go right now, download it, and then you have it for free. This game definitely got some mixed reactions, some mixed reviews. I personally thought the multiplayer was fun. But to be honest, I love the maps. I love the camos, the reactive camos. That's something that was introduced into this game. Just looking at all the assault rifles, man, I mean, so many iconic ones, and then even all the DLC weapons too. I mean, like the Peacekeeper, the AN-94. Some machine guns were just so OP. I mean, I loved the Cordite. The SOG was crazy in competitive play, and then, you know, the VMP, the Micro MG. Goddamn, dude. Sniper rifles were insane. The Paladin, we have the Kashka. Even brought back the Locust from BO3. Oh my god. They literally had no reason snapping on this game with the amount of weapons. Like, the, what what is this, bro? There's some really, really unique and cool looking melee weapons as well. I didn't really run around with melee weapons that much, but there were a lot of unique ones. We got the ballistic knife and the reaver. I thought we would hop back on Black Ops 4 today, have some fun, show you guys what BO4 looks like and how it is for the people who have never played it before. Subscribe if you guys are brand new. Drop a like if you guys want to see more Black Ops 4 content. Make sure to use code RAID in the item shop. Unfortunately, you can't use it on Black Ops 4. If you're on Black Ops Cold War and Warzone, make sure to use my supporter creator code. It's just RAID, R-A-I. ID. Like I said, man, I love coming back to this game. It feels so good. Is it just me or does this game low-key look a little bit better than Black Ops Cold War? I don't know if I'm just tripping. I don't know if I'm just crazy, but I feel like this game actually looks better than Black Ops Cold War, which is like the newest Call of Duty game out. I know it's like different engines and I don't get a single thing about like game development and everything. I don't know what y'all did during Black Ops 4, but it looks a lot better than Black Ops Cold War, the game that's currently out now. The only thing I really didn't like about Black Ops 4 was the specialist system. System. I liked Specialist in Black Ops 3, and I thought it was a great, great, like, idea and something new to the game. Let me get you. Hold on. There we go. Okay. There's so many people. Dude, I'm on a streak. I'm on a streak. Come on, come on. Oh my god, this is so crazy. But the way they did it in Black Ops 4 is that every specialist has a specialist weapon and an ability, both on the class setup. So yeah, it was just a little bit overpowered, man, that everyone got a specialist weapon and an ability on their class setup. And I really did not like that, like, at all. Okay, there we go. We're actually on a streak right now. We have Scythe. Oh, we have the Scythe and we have the Sniper's Nest. We have Scythe, which I absolutely love. Hello? Where is everyone? Of course you have a crossbow. And I know a lot of people don't like it and a lot of people don't talk about it, but Black Ops 4 introduced the first Battle Royale. And of course, that was Blackout. Blackout really should have gone free to play right away. You should have never had to pay for a Blackout. It should have always been a free to play game. I think Warzone's definitely a better Battle Royale. Blackout should have been free to play, man. Like, what the hell? And really, really? It's actually so funny because there's so many noobs on this game now. And it's just kind of funny seeing low levels on Black Ops 4 in this year. You know what I mean? Like, it's actually kind of crazy. One thing I find pretty difficult, uh, you know, going from Black Ops Cold War and like the newer CODs to Black Ops 4 is that there's no FOV slider. So the game kind of looks zoomed in or it doesn't feel like you're moving as fast compared to the new CODs because you can't change your FOV. Dude, what the hell? You're level 21. You just hopped onto the game. Thank you. Okay. Come on, come on. There we go. Oh, I love this gun. Also, on Prestige 1, level 39, I ended up resetting my stats and going for Dark Matter again. So, yeah, I, uh, I'm a little bit behind. Oh, oh my god. What is this? What is this? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, let's go, baby. We're on a nice little Merciless. Hello. Oh, you're behind me. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, they're about to hack my score streaks. No, no, no. Zero is right here. 
No! Yup, they just destroyed my sniper's nest. I literally hate Zero so much. I think that's why Black Ops 4 has a bad rep because specialists are kind of overpowered and they kind of make the game just a little bit BS sometimes. Like someone can literally be doing the worst in the entire game, but pull out Zero, which is a specialist, and just hack all of your score streaks that you earn. So I get what people are coming from when they say Black Ops 4 is not the greatest Call of Duty in the world. I don't by all means think it's the greatest COD, but I think it is fun and definitely really entertaining. And of course, we can't forget about the supply drop system in this game. I know I'm talking about like, oh, specialists weren't that great, you know, blah, blah, blah. But one of the main things why people did not like Black Ops 4 was the supply drop system. It's much better now because you can actually use pick a weapon bribes and buy the exact DLC weapon you want. You don't have to open thousands and thousands of crates to get a DLC weapon, you know, a chance to get the one you want. You can literally buy the exact Mark II weapon or Mastercraft or DLC weapon you want now, which is amazing. They introduced these things, which is called an ultra weapon bribe, and it guarantees one new ranged weapon, which is awesome. But then again, like you only got one of these every single season, so it was still very difficult to get all the DLC weapons. I still have like five ultra weapon bribes. Uh, I don't know. Let's just open one. Screw it for the video. I have all the DLC weapons already, but let's just see what we get, man. All right, here, give it to me. And micro MG, of course. <laughs> this weapon's OP as hell. Camping motherfucker. <laughs> You're camping on a head glitch. I literally just got there. This guy is getting so mad, bro. You love camping, don't you? <laughs> I'm not even camping, bro. Hostile. Oh my gosh. You're, oh my god. And these guys are getting so mad. Oh, I feel, I actually feel so bad, bro. I am using the VMP, so obviously this is nothing crazy, but uh. There we go. And you're camping our spawn. <laughs> I know you're spawning there, bro. There's like two spawn points on this map. Chill. Oh, you're seriously that much of a f***ing loser. You literally camped the whole game. Fuck. Like, do you have no friends at all? <laughs> he said, do you not have any friends at all? Oh, man. Oh, I love this game. I love Black Ops 4, dude. <laughs> no lives. <laughs> And I get my body shot. Hey, it's like we never left, literally. The thing is, right away. Of course he knows me. Of course he knows me. Right away! I see you! What's up, bro? <laughs> Shit. Proud <laughs> available. Wait, I'm on a 20? I didn't even real- I literally didn't even realize I'm on a 20. I didn't even realize I'm on a 20. Okay. 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 No, no! I was 39 and 0. I was on like a 24. Oh my god, I forgot how good the auger really is in this game. It probably has like double high caliber, so it ups the damage a crap ton. What? Oh my god. Dude, this game is so fun. I think I have to play it for the whole month, man. I think I really, really do. Like, I figured there was gonna be some, you know, some easy lobbies, some new players to the game, but I can't actually believe how many new players are playing. There's obviously going to be sweats on this game because this game's been out for obviously a few years, but seriously, you will come across some crazy lobbies where you're like, what the hell, man? This guy right here. Oh, this guy is a, such a sweat though, Loki. I feel like I definitely could grind for level 1000 on this game again, honestly. Especially now that the game is free. I can, I feel like I could see myself doing it. Dude, this should have been a nuke, man. I was so close to the nuke. Thank you all so much for watching today's Black Ops 4 video. All right, listen, if this video just hits a crazy amount of likes, like 15,000 likes or something like that, I will try and get back on this game and grind for level 1000 again. So yeah, let's, let's, let's say that. 15,000 likes and I will attempt to grind for level 1000 again on Black Ops 4. Subscribe to the channel if you are brand new. Thank you all so much for watching and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.